how to pray. I'm going to teach you all how to pray. And this is the correct way to have your hands open. Because when your hands are closed, how can you receive something? So this is wrong. Clasping your hands, this is all wrong. Guess who came with this type of prayer? Clasping your hands and closing your eyes. When the Bible says pray with your eye open, yeah, and open your hands. But you know, we don't follow these people. Exodus chapter 9 verses 22. Yahweh said to Moses, stretch forth your hand toward the sky that there may be hail in all the land of Egypt on man and on animal and on every herb of the field throughout the land of Egypt. So if you want something from the Most High and you're asking him to give you something so you can do something, then this thing yeah, that you're asking for, you have to have your hands open to receive it. Don't watch the color. So this is somebody giving you something and this is you receiving something and this is just natural common sense. So this is how you pray. Let's get it. Evening and morning and at noon will I pray and cry aloud and he shall hear my voice. All praises unto Yahweh power of Yasharala. Let's get it. Holy Bible. Matthew chapter 6 verses 10. How to pray Yahweh's prayer. In your prayers do not babble. As the pagans do, for they think that by using many words they will make themselves heard. Do not be like them. Your father knows what you need before you ask him. So you should pray like this. Our Father, who art in heaven, may your name be hell holy. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we have forgiven those who are in debt to us. And do not put us to the test, but save us from the evil one. Do you realize at the top right here, daily bread, it says right next to it, see, let's get it. C. The Greek word is obscure. This traditional rendering is a probable one. The other possibility is necessary for subsistence or for tomorrow. Whatever the exact translation, the sense is that we must ask Yahweh for sustenance we need in this life. But for no more. Not for wealth or luxury. The Father applies, the fathers applies this text to the bread of the Holy Eucharist. Eucharist, the Israelite service ceremony or sacrament commemorating the Last Supper in which bread and wine are consecrated and consumed. It's not Christian. We weren't Christians. We're Israelites, the Israelites. Twelve tribes of Israel. But save us from the evil one. D. D or from evil. Add, for yours is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Full stop. Amen. Remember I told you that was Amen Ra? A reading introduced into the text through liturgical influence, you know? Amen. So when you're praying, face the east towards Zion. Say the Father's prayer with your hands open towards the sky. Then you will be praying properly. Show the commandments for the Most High to hear your prayers. Shalom.